This is to demonstrate how the Jamalto SafeNet key management and encryption platform KeySecure can help you create an effective test environment without using your production data. I'll be using a virtual environment of three Windows 2012 R2 servers for this demonstration, consisting of one server as my source SQL database server, one server as my destination SQL database server, and a third server as the tokenization server and vault. And of course, I'm also running a fourth virtual server, which is the KeySecure virtual appliance, which we will be accessing by the HTTPS graphical interface. The use case we will be demonstrating is creating test data to accurately simulate your production environment. Tokenization is the process of substituting a sensitive data element and a non-sensitive equivalent, referred to as a token. The token to plain text relationship is contained in an encrypted token vault. I'll be using a small JavaScript written specifically for this demonstration just to illustrate the power of the Tokenization Manager API and what is achievable with very little development on your part. In this use case, we have our production database on the left, our test database on the right, and a third database which serves as our token vault. This server is also where we have installed the Tokenization Manager application software and where we will be executing our little demonstration script. The script will make a call and retrieve the data from the production database, tokenize the data, store the relationship in the encrypted tokenization vault, then send the tokenized values to the test database, resulting in tokenization of the first name, last name, and email columns. On the Key Secure Management Console, you can see I have registered three separate token vaults, one for each column. This is because I'm using different token types based on different data I'm tokenizing. Now let's have a look at the process in action. On the left is a production database with our production data. As you can see, we have a query showing the first name, last name, and email columns of the customer table. On the right, the test database with an empty replica of the production database. The same query producing an empty result set. Below is our tokenization manager server with our tokenization vault. Let's go ahead and run the demonstration JavaScript. The script is retrieving the data from the production database and tokenizing the values, storing the relationship in an encrypted form in the tokenization vault, then populating the test database on the right. Now let's run that query on the test database again. As you can see, we now have representative data which we can safely use for testing without fear of compromise. Thank you for watching, and for more information on how we can help you protect your data, please visit safenet.jamalto.com.